safe back at home. We're not talking about the O's, we're talking about a piece of fine, fine art. Today was historic for the Baltimore Museum of Art. Its long missing Renoir painting is finally back after vanishing for more than six decades. ABC 2 News' Tim Rutherford was there for the major unveiling. Measured against the many canvases hanging here at the Baltimore Museum of Art, Impressionist Pierre Renoir's On the Shore of the Seine is almost petite by comparison. But this small five by nine inch painting has become a global sensation. This little painting and its odyssey of loss and recovery have captured um, the attention of the, really the entire world. It's thought Renoir painted the scene around 1890 for his mistress at a waterside restaurant in Paris. His canvas was a table linen. If you get close to the painting, you'll actually be able to see the, um, the, the weave. While on display here at the museum in 1951, the painting was stolen and thought lost forever. It reappeared just 18 months ago at a flea market in West Virginia where it was purchased by a local woman who put it up for auction. Alerted to the find, the auction was stopped and a court recently awarded ownership back to the museum. Today was the grand Hong uh, For us, the painting is uh, valuable because of its connection to Renoir, its exemplification of Renoir, its connection to Sadie May, and the ways in which we can use it in exhibitions like the one we have up now. Baltimore-born Sadie May was an art collector who purchased the Renoir in 1925 and at her death donated her entire collection to the BMA. Sadie May, who is, this, who is a wonderful collector, very generous person, and someone who really changed the face of this museum. And we hope it will bring a lot of people to the museum, maybe new and curious people who will become engaged not just with this individual work and this story, but with the many stories that can be told throughout the museum. Sadie May's eye for beautiful art will once again give visitors here an eyeful of a little painting with a uniquely Baltimore story. In Baltimore, Tim Rutherford, ABC2 News. Tim says TV doesn't do it justice. You gotta go see it. The painting's gonna be on exhibit at the museum through July.